Bill Walker arriving at Edinburgh Sheriff Court this morning, his last moments as a free man. Last month he was found guilty of 23 counts of domestic abuse against his three former wives and his stepdaughter over a 28 year period. This morning he learned his fate. Sheriff Catherine Mackey told Bill Walker that however incredulous he may be at the verdict, it was her duty to sentence him. She said that she had been unable to detect any evidence, either during the trial or from background reports, of any remorse for anyone or anything other than himself. She said with regard to the gravity of the offences, his extreme denial and complete absence of remorse, her only option was to give him a custodial sentence. She sentenced him to the maximum of 12 months in prison. His second wife Anne was beaten and punched by Walker. On occasion she had to go to hospital. He also attacked her 16-year-old daughter, his stepdaughter Louise. I don't really have any feeling of elation or anything like that. Um, in fact, I feel quite sad at times that it's had to come to this, you know. It wasn't my intention when this whole business was, you know, brought up that that um, I wanted to punish him in any way. My, mo my sole motivation was that I didn't feel he was a fit person to be a member of the Scottish Parliament. I, William George Walker. Last month, Bill Walker resigned as an MSP. He blamed the media. This morning, his lawyer said this had cost him his reputation and financially. Clearly he's disappointed at the outcome. He is still maintaining his innocence. An appeal has been marked. Does he really feel no remorse at all? He's maintaining his innocence. Yeah. You can't feel remorse for something you say you didn't do. An unedifying end for a man who seemed to set such stock by his public reputation. Katrina Renton reporting Scotland at Edinburgh Sheriff Court.